family of a 28-year-old San Francisco man who was shot and killed by police has filed suit against the city of San Francisco. That lawsuit comes on the five-month anniversary of Alex Nieto's shooting. Crown Force Dan Kerman is here with more details on this. Dan. Well, well Pam, it was on March 21st when the shooting happened. Alex Nieto shot and killed by police in his Bernal Heights, in a Bernal Heights park. Now, police have said after a 911 call, officers came to the park, confronted Nieto, and fired on him when they say he drew a weapon but it turns out that weapon was actually a taser. Family and friends have been calling for justice ever since this afternoon after a rally at Bernal Heights Park. They marched to the federal building. There they talked about the lawsuit, which accuses the San Francisco police of using excessive force. It was our belief that the claim that he had pulled a, uh, out his um, taser and pointed it at the police did not happen. That is a false statement, as a cover-up statement. Eric Gardner. That was family attorney John Burris. Earlier in the day, supporters of Nieto rallied at Bernal Heights Park, and at sunrise, they held a memorial there. Burris says this is a chance for vindication. He says he will bring forth witnesses that dispute the police account that he actually reached for a weapon. All Pam? Right. Dan, we'll look for an update. Thanks.